The final race of day one is a classic trial maiden over a mile and a half for three runs, of course. And the top one is a broken leaf for Dan Hughes, who's also got Al Manzor, Ecotatus for Jim Murray, Future Treasure for Greg Beckwith, Kivorsky for Paul Rose, Major Leagues Craig Allen, Storm Murmur, David Robertson, Bella Brandy, Joshua Sutherland, Sivius, Padre Hogan, Petrovna Location, David Robertson, Roaring Forties, Martin Little, Tesla Girl, Leon Van Rensburg, Tonight, Tonight, Alex Cherry, and Words as Weapons for Leon Van Rensburg. So 14 then, quietly installed and ready to go. And away they go. A little bit slow out closest to us was Storm Murmur, but nothing too drastic. And Equitatus, or Equitatus, yeah, Equitatus is it, who's going to take it up. One or two tongue twisters in this one. Kivorsky is in second, but Equitatus has got across to the inside rail and is the leader. So leads by three lengths in Equitatus to Kivorsky in second. Storm Murmur got over that tardy start. He's third in Future Treasure, Roaring Forties in the purple and white stripes. On the wide on the track is also close up as well. No one really wide on the track. He is Al Manzor looking towards the back words as weapons and a bright and leave a grey on the back to at this point. But it's Equitatus who's in the lead by a good three or four lengths with just a little more than a mile still to go. So Equitatus it is then. Roaring Fortress is now moved through into second. Kivorsky is third and then Major Leagues. Then comes Al Manzor. The two David Robertson and the next one in together now. Storm Murmur and Petrovna location. Bella Brandy is after that one. Tonight, tonight is next. And then Lascivious on the inside is going to need a good split up that inside rail. Looking towards the back. It's still words as weapons of the back marker. But it's Equitatus who's in the lead by about two now to Major Leagues and Kivorsky then comes Roaring Forties and then Almanzor Storm Murmur is after that one Roaring Forties just losing its place in there starting to shuffle down a pack maybe causing one or two problems for the horses in behind but it's Equitatus who's still in the lead as they pass the five furlong pole Equitatus then from Petrovna location in second then Major Leagues Kivorsky Almanzor Lascivious is after that one now probably got a clear run through Roaring Forties has switched to the outside and is trying to run on again Widest of all on the track is one of the Leon Van Rensburg horses. I think it might be Tesla Girl, but it's now coming up to challenge for the lead. Petrovna location. Petrovna location is coming through to challenge. So too Zal Manzor. Equitatus is sticking on. Roaring Forties is still there. So is Petrovna location, but Al Manzor hits the front. It's Al Manzor. Then in the lead as they race down towards the final two furlongs. Al Manzor is now a length and a half clear of Petrovna location. Equitatus is trying to stick on a break and leave the grace burst through on the inside. Major Leagues is still there as well. Words as weapons and warring forces are still trying to run, but it's Al Manzor then at the furlong pole. Al Manzor in the lead now. Major League starts to assert on the inside, and Major League hits the front. Major League hits the front, coming through with an absolute sweat sail. Is Equitatus who's got a second win, and Equitatus has burst through to take it. Incredible performance, looked like it was beaten, dropped out of it, and then came back in a way you don't see very often in real racing. But that one, well. A well, second spurt, didn't it? And um, Jim Murray on the winner's board with that one. Equitatus, the winner, major leagues for Craig Allen was second, Al Manzor for Dan Hughes was third, Storm Murmur for David Robinson was fourth, who also took fifth with Petrovna location. Mm.